Hello everyone. Introducing myself, my name is Karthik and I have been a student of physics all my life. We have taken up this in initiative to introduce you all with the way I have seen physics. Yes, you heard me right. The way I have seen physics. Physics is not a mere subject which can be learnt by reading a few lines in a textbook. It is a science of expression, it is a science of visualization and it is a science of application. All these three put together when you experience that experience is equal to a science called physics. I would like to start with an example. Assume that I have given you a book of 100 pages and asked you to finish reading in 3 hours. After the completion of 3 hours, I have told you that I am going to come back to you and ask you a few questions. Likewise, after 3 hours, I have come to you and I started asking a few details about the book. For any common individual, it is very difficult to tell or to remember each and every detail given in the book. But if the same book is shot as a video, as a movie, for probably one hour, two hours, then you go and watch it and come back, you remember every frame of it, you remember much more details in it. The reason being, the understanding is better in the second case, the reason being, you are into someone else's expression, you are into someone else's visualization. So it is very easy, it becomes much more easier to you all when you visualize the things. And storing the visualization is much easier than by hurting a few lines from a book. And also, a very common point that I hear from all my students is, Sir, I am very uh, good at uh, studying theory in physics, I can do derivations, I can write a lot of long answers, but it is very tough to solve numericals. And also everyone say, most of you all, you know, very commonly term numericals as problems. The moment you think them as problems, it is a challenge that is put up to you by someone else and it scares you. It is not a challenge and it is not a problem. A numerical has to be understood as a situation. A numerical is a story which involves a few numbers. So by reading a numerical, you have to absorb the data, understand the situation, visualize it completely. After visualizing, then you have to analyze what is given and what is required. And at the end, you have to solve it logically. So we have to use our common sense to solve uh, the given numerical logically. And where do we get that common sense from? We get it from physics. And a great mathematician over the years have given us so many tools so that we, can, we may use a few of them and connect the logical solution that we have to the numbers that are in the numerical. So my dear students, in our future interactions, I am going to teach you in detail about each and every concept of physics, but also emphasize a lot on solving the numericals. I will not bombard you with a lot of graphics that kill your imagination, but I will explain you a topic in such a way that you will be able to visualize it in yourself. And also, I would help you how to break a numerical, how to analyze it, then how to approach to the required solution at ease. So discussions about the concepts and helping you solve the numericals, both put together will give you a new experience towards learning physics. Thank you all for watching this video. We'll meet very soon and very often. Stay tuned for exciting experience with physics. Thank you.